Good morning, Peter. Hello. How are we doing? Shite, thanks for asking. Okay, it's nearly Christmas. As you might have noticed, if you looked at Batchet Crazy Hills' Christmas jumper. <laughs> oh, tits, <laughs> right? We haven't seen them for a while, have we? Oh, well. We, we well. need some more subscribers. <laughs> So, aye, it's the last gig of the year, and we're on our way down to King Tut's in Glasgow to see Tijuana Bibles. Uh, Tijuana Bibles are a band that I first saw at Belladrum Festival quite a lot of years ago, in the tiny seedling stage, and they were really, really good. So I was obviously very delighted when the Lantern of the North project in, in Elgin brought them to the Bishop Mill Hall, which is a little wooden hall just along the road from my house. And uh, we saw them in there with a couple of other bands and they were tremendous. And then they came back to Elgin again and they played in the um, the Druthy, when, when we used to have bands in the Druthy Cobbler before that turned shit and uh, changed hands and stuff. So, I I'm really looking forward to it. I haven't seen them. They, they were sort of making progress before Covid appeared and then it all just went to shit. So today is an album release and it's the first time that I've seen them for ages. We're meeting Stuart and Gav and Stuart saw them not that long ago. Stuart and Panties went to see the Tijuana Bibles instead of going to download. Who the fuck does that? Uh, I, maybe it was a wise move because downloads becoming sucky. So I'm going to do a separate video about how shit download has become but the TLDR is they're just ripping us off nowadays they're a corporate cash cow who cares very little for their customers So it came as no surprise when Live Nation uh, sponsored or, or promoted the tour by Slipknot for next December and I went to get tickets and standing was 125 quid or you could get an early entry package for the princely sum of £224 and that allowed you in early so you could get to the merch stand before everyone else it's an absolute disgrace so I think from uh, 2025 onwards my gig going is going to be very different I'm not putting up with getting ripped off anymore I mean, I'm not a skint man, I do alright for money, but I just, I'm feeling the butthurt of them just taking the piss when it comes to prices. So, I'm going to be supporting a little band. So there'll be fewer gigs, there'll be fewer festivals, well, there won't be big ones like Download, there might even be more festivals, because I could afford to go to more small ones. But, aye, I've uh, had enough of it had enough of being bent over a barrel and buttfucked by Live Nation, Festival Republic and people who just want your money, they have no care for the loyal fans anymore. Fuck you, bastards. Why 2025, I hear you say, why don't you do it now? Because I've already spent thousands on t tickets for next year for festivals and stadium gigs and shit like that. So yeah. I'm going to have to swallow my pride and suck it up for another year, but that's money's already spent, so it's like it's it's not happening. But yeah, I'm making my stand now, so from 2025 I am not buying a rip-off tickets ever again. We're being controversial, trying something different today. We're going to go to Newton Moore truck stop instead of Ballinlug or Brewer or Bankfoot. Yeah, or McDonald's at Perth, I we're trying something hopefully healthy, truck stop healthy, ah <laughs> my fucking arse, <laughs> but different anyway, change is as good as a rest, isn't it? Here we go. Oh, I don't know if you get that one. I don't know if you get that one. 
Fight you go to Hills. I've got a very drippy um, Snatch. <laughs> well and turkey and brie and cranberry toasty and uh, sweet potato and something soup. Sweet potato and uh, red pepper. Nice? Yes, just okay. like you. Cheese and tomato toasty, carrot and parsnip soup. Cup of tea. Bargain, but it's vegan, so. Krioshna! So, no trip to Glasgow for a gig is complete without going to Solid Rock for us. So that's where we're heading to first. What you got, Hills? Uh, fish and chips. Ah. What? Fish and chips. What did you have, Stuart? None of your fucking business. Same as me, Scooby Snaps, burger and chips, bro. Lovely. Curly fries. And cur curly fries. <laughs> curly fries. <laughs> Leek and Daddy Soup, Club Sandwich, awesome. <laughs> <laughs> He's perfect, yeah. <laughs> Click like and subscribe. What band is that? What's a misfit? I literally just told you. You said Death Toads. Who? Death Toads. No! <laughs> Ghost! No! <laughs> Not playing that game. <laughs> I told you two minutes ago. Yeah, no, he never. He's he dead? Misfits. Then you'll be on my video. <laughs> when, when you go, but when you go, when you go, when you go, fucking four, five weeks, right? My pal Mikey, my fucking drummer for Tara Radio, and I've come out the night and fucking. You're hanging in here? Oh, I'm fat, I'm hunting, I can't, I'm, I'm out of practice.